This quick lesson is going to be about delta t and flow through a boiler. We can solve for flow through a boiler if we know the delta t and the boiler output rate. Using the simple equation, rate of heat transfer, or Q, equals delta t times GPM times 500. Moving the equation around, we can solve for delta t or we can solve for GPM. If we know any two of these, we can calculate the third. So if we know the boiler output at high flyer or low flyer, it doesn't really matter, and we know our delta t by using an infrared, measuring the inlet and outlet, subtracting the two, and we know what 500 is, it's a conversion. A British thermal unit is the amount of energy it takes to heat one pound of water one degree Fahrenheit. But we're not using pounds on the other side of the equation, so we've got to convert. A gallon of water weighs about 8.3 pounds. Using 8.3 pounds per gallon times 60 minutes an hour, we come up with 498, which is about 500. And that's why we use 500. Let's finish the math problem. Let's use a 2 million BTU boiler with an output of 87% of that, or about 1.7 million BTUs per hour. And let's assume we measured our delta T at 20 degrees. Inlet 160, the boiler raising that to 180 degrees, equals 170 GPM. And that's how you can use delta T to estimate your flow.